Adam Lambert shocked the world this week by admitting he's a fagala. He never fooled me because I got gaydar. Good for him. More chicks for me. Have a good time for yourselves, pillow biters. Faggots crack me up the way they fuck <laughs> each other in the ass. You know, they give each other the meat nozzle. And you know what's funny? When they do a turd cough after ass fucking. I'd like to see a photo of him farting cum out of his ass. I bet you his anal audio is better than his singing. And this has been the Hollywood 411 with me, Club Soda Kenny. The only 411 better than the morning mashup. Uh, goodbye. The Hollywood 411. One with Club Soda Kenny. That was... Who listens to these before we play Is he out of his mind? Can I get who, that who on Hulu? Who listens to that? Does the producer listen to this? Uh, I think Troy Kwan. His producer. No, but does our fucking producer? <laughs> our producer that, listened to that before that. I'm sure, Sam worked on it with him. <laughs> because I, I would assume that is a little over the top. A little as too much. Far even as, for uh, satellite radio. As far as um, yeah, offending certain groups that it, it's just that, po um, it was pointless. <laughs> I mean, there's something called subtlety. <laughs> Oh well. Um, Who had, double this economy? Entendre. Double entendre comes to mind. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, you know. Yeah, like like job preservation, <laughs> right? Uh, comes to uh, mind. You know things like that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I want to address a couple of people on phones too, for All being right. cunt, cock, rag, dick, fuck, oh, shit, bitch. Oh shit! Let's say yeah. hi to Mike in New York. Hey, Mike. Uh, seriously? Yeah. And dude. You make fun of everything. Everything. Yep, yep. A little, a little gay joke, right. really? A little gay <laughs> joke, right, right. Dude, you gotta admit, you're a pussy. Listen to the you don't, you, you, don't listen to, you don't listen to that, Mike, and, and think perhaps it might get... Do you think I give a flying fuck? Huh, Mike? Answer me, cunt! <laughs> pussy, I'm trying to keep a job! Dude, you Dummy! Now, this is one thing that you have a problem with? Mike, you're being unrealistic. Do, do you honestly think the company wouldn't have a problem? Do you think I sit here and have a problem with a lot of shit? I look at stuff in the big picture and go, I think somebody has to listen to something to see if someone else is going to have a problem. Do you understand what the fuck I'm even talking about, you dumb son of a cunt? Hey, so what? Yeah, all right, hold on. When, when you're making uh, black jokes, why why you... Uh... No one said you can't make gay jokes. Did I ever, you, did I ever drop the N-bomb on this fucking show? All right, we, we know... Did I? Da answer me, <laughs> you fucking asshole! Answer me! Awkward. <laughs> did I? Did I? Did I? Mike? Yes? Shithead? Dave, just look down. Huh? Listen... You make enough, just relax, dude. It's, it's, no Shut the right. fuck up! Shut up! You need to relax. Shut your fucking mouth, Mike. What's the matter? You didn't get any last night? Get any? Yeah, you had that whore fucking cunt mother of yours came over <laughs> and sucked my fucking dick, drained the cum out of it, and I pumped it all down her fucking throat till it came out her nose, that whore cunt mother of yours. Heterosexual. Fuck you! <laughs> fuck you! <laughs> fuck you! Walk by Fraser's deep in her mouth. But Mike, could you say that again? We couldn't hear you. The phone cut out. Yeah, I get it. Uh, <laughs> uh, we got off on the wrong foot. I'm uh, sorry, Mike. Let, let's go to Keith in New York. Keith? No, uh, Anthony's the one who fucking... If that was a black joke, it would be no big deal. It's a fucking fag joke. He's going to make a big deal. What black jokes do I make? I'm not saying... Do you know how many gay jokes we make on this show and how many black jokes and how many any other jokes we make on this show? You're being a when, when you use the term <laughs> fag, don't, don't when you that. use the term fag, in a derogatory manner, as mm -hmm. far as gay people uh, go, you're asking for trouble. Not that. Do you think I'm fucking offended by the word fag? I'm being honest here. I could give a shit. <laughs> I'm hey, you're saying being a pussy. that. All right, I'll be a pussy. I'll be a pussy. You guinea fuck. I'm 17. There years we old. go. Fuck there you, we brother. go. All right. Every time you use the word fag, Neil Patrick Harris turns around. Yes. Wait, no. I'm trying to make a point, guys. <laughs> now, I got to be the asshole here for actually trying to keep us from... And these are... Every one of these motherfuckers would be like, What happened? They got suspended? They got fired? They got this? Where did all my anger? Where did... You fucking idiot. 17. Right, grow a hair on your ball. All right. Oh, well. You want any more of these phone calls in? I don't care. All right, which one do you want? You tell me. I don't care. Pick one. All right. Take them all. All comers. All right, I'll do this one for you. Kelly in Idaho. 
Oh, God. I just love when Anthony goes off on these idiots. Oh, thank I, I you. I'm See? a redneck from Idaho, but... Thank you, girl name. Stupid. <laughs> I realize it. It's not my job. All right. Well, you raise a good point, miss. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go to Knock in Washington. Knock. <laughs> go ahead, Knock. Hey, morning, boys. Hey, how you doing? Go ahead. I love, I love this because I have an answer for you already. Go ahead. What? Hey, you know, I agree with you as far as as needing to be careful. Yeah. Uh, job protection, man. So it, the bottom line is, is that you've got glad you've got these other groups who are trying to fuck you guys over. Yes. So, you know, in, in terms of that, but at the same time, where where do you draw the line? You, you do, you guys are an edgy show. So yes, we're an edgy show, and we're on satellite radio. But you know something? We got fucking suspended from satellite radio because a homeless guy decided to talk about how he wants to have sex with the president's wife. Uh, uh, Barbara, uh, or what's the name? Laura Bush. Laura Bush and, and, Condoleezza, and Condoleezza Rice. Rice and the Queen of England. It was a homeless guy who was hysterical. Came in homeless ramblings into the microphone, and they suspended us from satellite radio because of that. I remember. I don't feel I, I, like being fucking suspended or fired anymore. I, agree, I really, man, I I'm agree. kind of out of that point in my fucking career <laughs> where I want to sit at home wondering how I'm going to pay for my shit. I agree, Anthony. <laughs> Uh, I'm exiting with my arms <laughs> randomly punching. Bye bye. All right. So I. So no more firings. How about one more for old times? I'll take old times. one. I'll old take times. one more when we're ready. When we're ready, a blaze of fucking glory, my friend. <laughs> the best blaze of glory. The best part. This might be a little inside, but oh. Mike R. and Pat Shaw goes. I love how Ant said he's never uh, dropped the N word on this show. No, of course not. Not on this show. Hmm. I don't drop the N bomb in public on any show. No, right? Well, you do lean over and whisper it often. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know what? Uh, this guy wants you just to calm down. Uh, Larry in Connecticut. Larry. Larry. Hey. We appreciate what do you want, your, Larry. We appreciate your opinion on this uh, radio show yes. of ours. Well, thank you, sirs. Uh, <laughs> first of all, I want to say I'm looking forward to seeing Opie and. Uh, Schneider from One Day at a Time on Jimmy Fallon. <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. That's right, Pat Harrington. Uh, he starts out with a good joke. I'll give him that. <laughs> Schneider. No, I'm going to roll did, some cigarettes up in my did sleeve. Did anyone come up with that one yet? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I've said it many times. Yeah. No. no you're I haven't said it. You're a handsome gentleman, sir. Yeah, thank uh, you. I just wanted to say, <laughs> calm down, man. Uh, didn't you guys play a little ditty called Shit Dick yesterday? Oh, <laughs> yes, wait. we did. Yeah, David, tell him. That's so. I forgot about that. We did. We did play there shit. There is a bit of a difference on that one. Dude, Ant is totally right. He's not making a judgment on, like, that was tasteless. I don't go for that. I don't care. But he's talking about this shitty climate, and it's common sense. And I heard it, and I thought the same thing. I I'm, knew, and I'm not offended. I, I looked over at Jimmy as it was playing and went like, uh-oh. Believe me, I'd like to sit here and say everything that's in my head uh, every second of the day, <laughs> but I can't. Please don't. <laughs> but I can't. I can only do it through my rolled-up Escalade windows as I'm driving <laughs> through traffic with stereotypical people that can't drive. Listening to Wagner. But, <laughs> <laughs> but there aren't a lot of things on this. There really are not a lot of things no. that like make, like I said, that I'm, that I'm like fucking uh, very, could very be few. Right. Could be like a problem. That's all. I, I wasn't getting uncomfortable with the content. I don't care. Doesn't it, it's, it's not all, like it all bothers me like, oh gee, I'm personally offended. No, I'm just thinking like that's a that's a sticking point. That's like, oh boy. And you have oh, to think, boy. will the company back us? No. Right. Oh please. no. Exactly. Well. That's another thing. The company back us? Ha! No. What is that based on, eh? Uh, unbacking. <laughs> on a history of unbacking. Yeah. Wait for the book. Holy Not to shit. be backed. The latest one's amazing. Backless. The latest one's amazing. So, you know, I, I just kind of want to... That's all. I think you guys are cool. You're one gay listener. Yes. We have, <laughs> we our, have our gay two, listeners. Yeah, maybe three. Guy. I think we have three. We have some. We actually have so many more than you think. I'm, I no, actually I can't even. I, I can't do. even go into fucking peepos anymore. So I'm afraid <laughs> I'm going to peek through the glory hole and someone's going to go, "Happy birthday, little Jimmy." <laughs> <laughs> Jeremy's got Anthony some. He starts crying. Jeremy's got some advice for you. All right, Jeremy in Cleveland. Yes. Hey, Anthony, you got to calm down. You're going to blow out those hair plugs before that big. I don't have hair right. plugs. All right. You know, oh, you want to keep the hair plugs in your head. I man. don't have hair plugs. Imagine if you touch that fucking wire. 
What would happen? That Nothing. hair would come I would flying just, out. I would yeah. fall down just like the guy did on the train. Yeah. And no plugs would go shooting they'd out be, of my they'd head. Be, they'd be launched like fucking 4th of July uh, like up. fireworks. It would look like a hair sparkler or something. <laughs> up. Just flying out. They call them something chasers. I can't remember. Oh! That. See how he brings oh, it all back, look people. look at me. What did I say? You're yeah, crazy. Masterful. You're a shock jock. Yeah, that's me. Let's get the fuck out of here.